So guys, how do you get access to your device? It's an Android device. Uh, if you have forgotten the pin or the password. So let's say you just uh, encrypted your device and you forgot the pin or the password for your encrypted Android device. So there's one way you can get access to but if you have a memory card and all you just have to remove those uh, memory card because you won't lose the data in that memory card. But if it is uh, uh, internal memory you have saved something in the internal memory you might lose your data because there's only one way you will get access to your device now so you can use the different third-party software uh, they might help you to get access but uh, the simple and the free and the easy way if you think uh, you don't have so precious data in your internal memory and you are ready to hard reset your device so the hard reset is one easy way you can just uh, get uh, get access to your device again so in order to do that you just have to uh, hold you just have to just uh, try to power off this device you can see here the volume button just uh, hold it and you can see the option to power up so power off your device now just click on power off to power off do you want to power off click on power off you're gonna tap and hold so do not release the volume off button you can see volume off button tap and hold it now you're gonna tap and hold home button so you are holding the volume up button you are holding the home button also now you're gonna press the power button so do not release it okay guys when you see this logo now you can release it Okay, now you're gonna choose volume up and down button to select. So volume down button to go down. You wanna see this option? It's a wipe data factory reset. So you're gonna choose that. It's a wipe data factory reset and then press the power button for OK. Volume up and down button for going up and down and power button for OK so normally most of the phone will not ask you for this option if it asks you're gonna use the volume up and down button and select this delete all user data and then press power button for OK now you can see it is doing its work when you see the message over here it's completed now you're gonna choose the first option over here it doesn't matter whether it is in first or the last you're gonna choose this option reboot system now choose the option and press power button for ok now you can see it's uh, rebooting it's gonna take some time Now you can select the language. 
you can do the Wi-Fi settings You can connect to the Wi-Fi, click on next, agree to the terms and conditions. Now you can add your Google account and give a moment to set up your device and get ready. So finally, here is your phone. Once the setup is completed, so now you can use it. So if you like this tutorial, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe and comment. Have a good day.